Yes. Mm -hmm. See, I was looking at my business. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> American enterprise in the form of stocks and bonds that we have purchased. Uh -huh. Because business plays so prominent a role in our lives, it is useful to have some knowledge of how it is organized. <laughs> Now, fundamentally, yes, there are three major types of business organization. Mm -hmm. These are the individual proprietorship, yes, the partnership in the corporation. <laughs> now, each type of organization has its strong or weak points that make um, it particularly suitable yes, for certain specific purposes <laughs> and unsuitable for others. <laughs> If you are thinking about going into business or changing the form of uh, your business, naturally, uh -huh, your first move would be to consult with an attorney, <laughs> preferably one well-versed in business matters to determine which type of organization <laughs> is most appropriate for your needs, how to get started in business, yes, <laughs> and how to cope with problems. <laughs> The following sections will help you understand your attorney's legal advice. <laughs> now, let's say I was to consult with an attorney. Yes. I was uh, surfing the Internet and I was on the Facebook. Yes. Friending various individuals that I'd like to be friends with. <laughs> and I was researching the, uh, is it a sole proprietorship or a corporation of a woman that is a recognized um, shooter? Yes. Mm -hmm. She's she'd done something of significance yeah well on facebook there was her actual website because when you when you click on it it has this about a b o u t yes mm -hmm. could you give me every website that is included in all facebook profiles mm -hmm. of the individuals that own businesses Poop! <laughs> Now, Facebook is a good way to research possible businesses that you'd like to do business with. Yes. <laughs> well, I I clicked on it, but I didn't. I, I do one of these where it, with the mouse, you can open it in a separate tab. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was kind of in the separate tab. Yes. Going through this woman's business, and she's a marketer of different marketing ideas. Yes. And I clicked on this image of these beautiful women that all happen to be very good with guns. Yeah. Now, you would have thought there would have been nothing behind there. And I had thought that maybe there was like an article or PDF or something that I could download so I could read it. Because it was an article about something, uh, don't screw up your business or something like this. <clears throat> and since I was thinking about my business at the time, I thought, well, maybe I should employ somebody to help me. <laughs> Well, wouldn't you know, I went to QuickBooks uh, webpage. Yes. And on that webpage was a link to the Facebook profile of QuickBooks. <laughs> now, how Facebook got behind a picture of a woman's business-owned uh, uh, website. <laughs> See, I didn't get to her. I got to her website through the uh, website that is on the About on the Facebook profile. Yeah. Just get me all those websites on Facebook right now. <laughs> Now, let's say, okay, I'm really serious about employing this woman's business. Yeah. But you took me to a different product or service that happened to be a different company. Yes. Now, I was looking to download a PDF of the actual image of those beautiful women that all shoot guns. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thinking I would learn something about how not to screw something up. <laughs> But then I did it twice, and I thought, well, I'll just click on the Intuit's website, yes, the Facebook profile. That's why I put it on a post of my own Facebook profiles. Yes, he did. <laughs> well, after a few minutes, I went back, and there was this confirmation click, and I thought, well, there was something different behind the picture than what I had found out. Mm -hmm. Now, I would say that as a potential client of the woman, yes, I can sue whomever the marketing is. Yes, that is using that woman's website without her knowledge. Yes, that happens to be driving traffic away from her actual business. Yes, to another website that she has no ownership of and has no knowledge of. Yes, he can. <laughs> now, I'm going to consult with an attorney on this. <clears throat> Because I'm going to want some attorneys. <laughs> I just want every website on all the Facebook profiles where you can go to one of these hyperlinks. Yes. Or the actual dot com. <coughs> and then um, you could find out about the business and possibly do business with them. <laughs> 
Now, I don't think I have to spend any money uh, with that woman, though I might ask her if she'd like to be employed by me. Yes. And she could keep her personal business, and I just asked her if she'd like to do her business in my office. Yes. So that we can have a real close, intimate relationship. Good for you. <laughs> now, let's say, okay, that my attorney's legal advice is I should sue Facebook, I should sue Intuit, and I should sue the marketing organization that is using the websites. What if my attorney's legal advice was that? What if that would be something? <laughs> 